Hello, my name is Ernesto Espinosa, and I am an insurance broker in Florida since 2002. I made this video to help people who are turning 65 and have questions about Medicare. This is part two sequence of the part one video. If you have not seen part one, I recommend you do that now, previous to watching this video. Let's continue then with the most common questions and answers. What do I do after I got my Medicare card with part A and part B? There are two options you can choose to cover for those things which Medicare Part A and Part B do not cover, and that depends on your financial situation. First is Medicare Advantage Plan C. Second, Supplemental Medicare. What is Medicare Advantage Part C? Medicare Advantage Part C is a type of Medicare health plan offered by private companies approved by Medicare. It is also known as Medicare Advantage Plan, MA Plan. If you enroll in a Medicare Advantage Plan, the plan will provide all of your Part A, Part B with little or zero copays. And most Medicare Advantage Plans also include Prescription Drug Coverage Part D. Medicare Advantage Plans also offer a maximum out-of-pocket, which is a maximum spending limit, which provides financial protection in the event of a catastrophic illness. Additionally, this might offer extra coverage such as vision, hearing, dental, and or health and wellness program. Medicare pays a fixed amount for your care every month to the private companies offering Medicare Advantage plans. And these companies must follow the rules set by Medicare. However, each Medicare Advantage plan can charge different out-of-pocket costs and have different rules for how you get services. These rules can change each year. What is Part D coverage? Medicare Part D is the prescription drug coverage. How much do I have to pay for my Medicare Advantage Part C? Most Medicare Advantage plans have zero dollar premium cost to the clients. However, there are some plans for which you pay a little premium. How do I pay for the Part B premium to Medicare? You can either select to have the premium deducted from your Social Security retirement pension if you are already collecting it. Or you can pay by having the government deducting it from your bank account or choose to send the payment each month. What is Supplemental Medicare? Supplemental Medicare, also known as Medigap, is extra insurance you can buy from a private health insurance company to help pay your share of out-of-pocket costs in Original Medicare. It works alongside Original Medicare Part A and B to provide additional financial protection and peace of mind for you. Medicare supplemental insurance policies are standardized and identified by letters A through N. Each standardized policy must offer the same basic benefits no matter which insurance company sells it. However, some policies offer additional benefits such as dental, vision, and hearing with additional premiums. So you can choose which one meets your needs. When you choose a Medigap plan to supplement your free Medicare coverage, you will have to pay for its premium, the Part B premium to the government, and additionally, 
you will have to buy a prescription plan D. What is the difference between Medicare Advantage and Medigap? Medicare Advantage is a bundle alternative that includes coverage of original Medicare Parts A and B, and extra benefits often with non-monthly premium. While Medigap is extra insurance you can buy from a private insurance company to help you pay your share of out-of-pocket costs in original Medicare. Medicare Advantage plans have a network of doctors and hospitals, and you must get care within the plan's network of doctors and hospitals unless it is an urgent or emergency situation. While Medigap works alongside Original Medicare and allows choosing any doctor who accepts Medicare for additional financial protection and peace of mind for you.